Hello everybody, my name is Christinator. Welcome back to Let's Play Amnesia The Dark Descent. In the last episode we got a wine cellar key, which hopefully now we can go into the wine cellar and, cre and collect those chemical ingredients that Daniel needs to move on. And obviously I need to obviously put them in the chemistry pot in the, here. We were just in the lab, we just finished reading a note that had the key on this desk. And now all we have to do now is get to the wine cellar, which should be very easy. Am I right? Yes. Should be very easy. What have I Moving on, let's get to the wines. Oh Jesus Christ, what the fuck was that? What was that? Oh my god. I don't feel safe here, I really don't. <coughs> Fuck. I need to get out of here. No, get out of here. Get out of here. I'm not having any of that. A handful of sand trickled from the crumbling stone ceiling and pushed down on the brim to his hat. He braced himself as the cavern suddenly shifted and settled. Place is possessed. Possessed by what? I don't know. I need to get to the wine cellar now. What's that? Wine cellar. There we are. There we are. There we are. Get the key. Statues were praying, gazing into the dark, domed ceiling. What's it all about ceilings? I saw a pissing ceiling in the first episode. Oh my god, the atmosphere. What is wrong with this place? Where did the Baron go? Who cares? He left nothing up wine the last of the lifetime! Or at least until tomorrow! Barrels. Looks like I got cuprite, which is a chemical ingredient. Cuprite, cuprite, whatever you say it. I'm not sure it's right. Correct me if I'm wrong, viewers. Uh, there's another one. Oh my god. Oh, he just got dunked by a barrel. <laughs> he got dunked by on his head. Sanitary is dangerously low. Well, I haven't got any. Anything that can help with that. Oh dear, he's not very well, is he? Ah, <laughs> uh, pick it up. Oh, I know you're weak. I get it. Let's, do I really have to move this shit out of the way? Strength. It'd be better common sense to move the ones on the bottom first, wouldn't it? Yeah, there we go, that's better. Get this out of the way. And then get this one. Move it. Move it, man. How am I gonna move it? There we go, there we go. Progress, progress. Is that better? I need something that can really help with my sanity because this is a good. So 
sanity better now? Oh. It's a little bit better. I'm just escaping that one room by the looks of things. No, nothing in there. It's anything that falls. What's happening? Oh, it feels like my chest is going to burst. Oh. I assume that this, this is where this man got. My God, Wilhelm, do something! Accept it. We're not getting out of here. How can you say that? Alexander, you piece of shit! Let us out of here! <laughs> you piece of shit! <laughs> My name is Wilhelm, the house of Garrick. This, these, there are my final words, my confession and testament. Two years ago, I was summoned to the castle Bredenburg. As most of the aristocracy, I was curious about what is supposed, what this supposed knight of the order could want from me and accepted the invitation. The baron was friendly and offered me a proposition. The dawn, it dawned on me that the nature of the contract was sordid and was the reason that, that I was chosen was because of the fol follies of my past and not the honours I've been rewarded with during my time as a soldier. I was to kidnap healthy humans upon his slightest whim and to do so without asking questions. In return he would attest to my character at the royal court, advancing my position with noble society. I would like to claim that I had struggled with my decision, but it came swiftly and I accepted wholeheartedly. Ever since that day, I brought men, women and children to Brandenburg. I can't remember the numbers, but there were many, perhaps even a hundred, none of whom were ever seen or heard from again. Tonight the Baron invited me and my men down to the wine cellar to celebrate our work. I had my suspicions as we descended the stairs, but he insisted and joined us at a toast. The wine tasted fine and my men drank without restraint. So it begins with the punishment of our sins. The Baron has locked us up and returned upstairs. Forgive me for what I've done. I was weak and I fell into these diabolic ways. My men are screaming. Their skin has been pierced by their own tangled bones. I feel my insides revolt against their God-given nature. Blood has begun to pour from my eyes, and I can no longer. Wow. Hey, footy footy steps. I can't be everything in there. What else did I get from there? I've got three chemistries. Can I? Oh yeah, the chemistry. Well, I can't do that yet. So all the rooms checked. No. Nope. This can't go in there yet. If an enemy is near, what do you mean? Sanity is dangerously low again. Oh, what's that? Oh no! Oh god! Oh Jesus! Oh my god, that's a loud damn proof I have there. I'd like us something to do with my sanity, please. Like a sanity potion of some sort? Do they exist? They must exist. I'd like one of those instead. I can't believe I just saw that. What was that? It just went. <laughs> What's that? Tinderbox. <laughs> Got it. I need. I need a sanity of some sort. Sanity. Is there anything? My sanity is so shit. My health is... Right, my health is fine now. Maybe I shouldn't have just used that on that little bit. I don't see anything... That could help. Getting 
closer somehow. I just assume that's all the chemicals now. Oh, crystal clear. Sanity's great. Lovely. Picking up something that can just. Alright, do we get out of here now? I'm getting out of here. It became impossible to avoid the commotion in the streets begged for his attention as he opened the shutters and the fridge shoulders opened and fired to the two young men finding back their voices were silenced in a haze gaze of in a haze of gun smoke. Is it the appropriate apparatus? The pieces lay scrambled on top. Too many of them, he thought, or perhaps too few. I'm not gonna lie, right? After that, how does Goop attack a man? Honestly. He must be possessed. There's gotta be some sort of chemistry within these rooms. Chemistry, you know, tools and swords. Has to be something. Has to be something. Has to be something. It's got to be something of sorts. I have no idea. I'm sure I checked all the rooms. I'm just being an idiot. I, I don't know where I'm going. What's at the end? <laughs> you bastard! Fucking hell, he's ugly as fuck. Mind you, I don't look any different. There's got to be a chemistry. Mixture of some sort where I can use those. Where I could use them, and I don't know where it is. Oh, yeah, I tried doing that, it didn't work. I don't know, I have no idea. Maybe it's not in this archives, maybe it's not. Is it in the old archives? Could be. It's definitely not in there. There's the laboratory. This must be where I can get the chemicals to sort them out. I'll go 
my eyes. jump higher than that. in that goop though that you could have probably crawled underneath and have to, oh, instead of going through all of that but there you go that uh, works still all right i think i'll leave this episode here thanks everybody for watching episode three of amnesia the dark descent i have i love this game so much it's amazing can't wait to do more amnesia games or probably custom stories if we can find any i'm sure you guys will love that but thanks everybody for watching this episode, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye. She <laughs> fucking died from a fucking. You just fucking died from a fucking spider. Oh, oh. oh I got it.